You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures. Thank you very much for arresting that stupid Nebeche who was claiming supremacy over us all. Now that Nebeche is gone, I think I'll be the next in line to be the chief mate. <laughs> but what I'm saying, Omar, I think the queen will want to make her the chief mate. <laughs> is that why you are scared? Don't bother yourself. Hmm? I'll make you the chief man. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Were you able to convince Safama to sleep with me? I am still trying. Uh, but she's claiming earlier than that. <laughs> Hope uh, she doesn't know about us. She must have a little insight since mm. I'm talking to her about you. Mm. Mm. Okay, don't worry yourself. Um, oh, oh, hurry up and vacate this place before the queen and uh, her son comes in. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> All of us are colleagues. I'm the security here. I want to see the king. Okay. Call me the king. Okay. Say me you call king. Obi Agabu. They say call king.
um, uh, officers, I hope there is no problem. Problem. Your attention is needed at the station for questioning. My attention is needed at your station? Yes. Um, it's all right. Um, go. Uh, I will be coming. No, Your Majesty. Your attention is needed urgently at the station. Like it is right now. We need your attention now. Abe, you shut up before you use grammar and spoil everything. Eh? To say everywhere soft, maybe one call I go make, they go, no way to happen. See, madam, uh, hey, something hey, very... Hey, hey. What is wrong with all of you? Yes? Will you let the cat out of the bag? So, 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 okay, so we know what is wrong, eh? Actually, police don't arrest the king. Yes. Uh, 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 just shut up. What king was arrested? Yes, the DPO gone gone, now you arrest him. That DPO for the station. Now you go arrest him. What are you talking about? No, man, I'm not going to be arrested. Why is that? Sh shut up! Chibuzo, please. Please take me to the station. I, who knows tomorrow? Nobody knows tomorrow. Oh, yeah, Mechi. In my Mechi, Dimeo. To make you cool, yo. Cool, yo. Cool, yo. Make you cool. They lost tomorrow So because you be prince you the post now okay. Some people not king for their end okay. With your car you the flesh now okay. Some people get them plenty for their end okay. I, every day one uh, If you go slap you go punch you uh, Every day for lava uh, Now which can kind of prince you be this you My brother quiet to yourself uh, Quiet to yourself the level where you cannot be by power. Yeah. Quiet yourself. DPO, can you tell me why you are holding me here? What sort of humiliation is this? Are you aware that I'm the holder of a fuck umu? Are you aware of all this? Are you aware that I'm a government recognized traditional ruler? You cannot be treating me less human. You cannot be treating me like a common criminal here. Yeah? You are holding me against my wish. Are you aware? Igwe. Igwe. You have been accused of adoption and murder. And Igwe, you know, you know how close you and I are. And that's the reason why I've been keeping calm. You see, you need to tell me the truth. Be sincere. Are you guilty of this accusation? What sort of rubbish question is that? It's so demeaning to ask me such a question. If I'm guilty or not. I understand you. I see you. Nebechi. Here is the king. You are you agreed that you actually wanted to wipe him out of this earth. I wonder. I wonder. Yes, DPO. And what are your reasons? When I was ten years old, this evil man came to my house to see my father. My father asked my mother and I to excuse him. 
as God may have it, where he's dropping and peeping, as if we already knew what he was going to do. Mr. Korafo, can I speak to you in private? My heart is heavy. Each time I remember the crime we committed, it breaks my soul. I, I, I understand. So what do you want to do now? Igwe, I want to go and report myself to the police. Yes, so I can ease my heavy heart. As soon as possible. As soon as possible. Okay. Okay. Call me when you're set. Because I, I, I want to set myself free from this from this bondage. Igwe. I thought I asked you guys to leave. So you were hip stopping. I am asking you for the last time. What crime did you commit with the Igwe? Because I heard all you said. I heard you saying you are going to the police station to, to make the confession. So tell me. Tell me the crime you committed with the Igwe. Okay, I, I think I should let you know now. The Igwe has always been my friend. Years ago, he came to me. He told me he needed a son. An heir to his throne. Meanwhile, the wife was pregnant, carrying a baby girl. And there was another woman who was also pregnant in the same world. She was carrying a baby boy. The queen gave birth to the baby girl, but she died. The woman's son survived. So the Igwe came to me and begged me to change the child. I have to change the boy for a girl and the girl for the boy. I gave the Igwe the woman's son. What? Oh no. Why? Why? My heart is really breaking me right now. Honestly. 
I want to go and report myself to the police and also to the family. I need to make some confessions. I was overwhelmed with the five million naira he gave to me with which I built this house. I'm sorry. Daddy, why? Why? Why did you do it? I know that it's bad. I'm sorry, my baby. I didn't know what came over me. I'm sorry. Why? Why? <coughs> How could you sell your conscience for money? The same money you told me you were given by a white man you helped to procure an estate. <laughs> Why? My baby, please forgive. Please, then, come in. Welcome, His Majesty. It's your husband, then. Honey, honey. Yes, dear. Yeah. Give is here. Yeah. All right, I'm coming. Give way. We all. We had a deal, and I paid you awesomely. you a huge sum of money that helped you acquire this house. Why you think you want to run your mouth? You want me to allow you go to the police? Please. And bring my entire reign in this kingdom down? Please. No. no. Please. This was not our initiative. Shut up! Please don't kill my husband, please. Shut up, woman! No, Kafu. You killed my... Shut up! Come here! Yes, I killed your bastard mouth of a husband. Come here. Now listen. Do you want to die? God, I will spare your life. But you need to promise me.
damn it. I said it. That name rings a bell in my head. Nebicho Kurafo. The little girl I took to St. Mary's orphanage. Years back when I was still a junior police officer. St. Mary's orphanage? Yeah. That was where she was before she came to work for us. Yes. I picked her up where her parents were killed. And I took her to that St. Mary's orphanage. That was when I was still a junior officer. But, but why didn't you take her to any of her relatives? I took her to her relatives. But they, they rejected her. Oh. Calling her names that she was a cursed child. So I was left with no other option than to take her to the orphanage. Thank you so much, Stan. God bless you. Your Majesty, thank you so much. You are a good woman. And God will always bless you. The quest for revenge was what drove me to come seek for job at the palace. This man is not worthy of a king and does not deserve a good woman like you as his wife. I'm sure by now he must have slept with all the maidens in the palace. Yes, because he made approaches to me severally, but I turned him down. No, 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 no. no. Tell me it's not true. I can't believe this. You know what? I'm out of here. Dear, you can rot in jail for all I care. I want to see you in Ibn Doka, whatever you have to say, reserve it till we get to court. You see, just, I, I have my dignity to be there. What reputation are you talking about? You're a murderer. You wiped away this poor girl's family. And you're talking about reputation. You will face the full wrath of the law. Your car you the flesh now okay. Some people get them plenty for their end okay. I, every day wahala ah. If you not slap you could punch you ah. Every day palapa ah. Now which can principle be this you My brother quiet to yourself now ah. Quiet to yourself ah. The level where you then not be by power ah. Quiet to yourself Say my brother, quiet to yourself. Quiet to yourself. The life where you the live not be by power. Quiet to yourself. See the level where you're there today. It is nothing to some people out there. So make you quiet to yourself. 
Say they come on slow move. The queen, they cry. The prince squeeze face like sponge. The king, they don't arrest her. See, over this one pass Olympus has fallen on. See, you know, go sack person now. That's why they do they see you now, they see sacking. But this wait. No, 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 waiting person, no, you go to people where you carry con, they call everybody come back, Mama, madame, they cry, or God is peace face, you say, you know, no, I don't know, you go know when you lose your job. Hmm, oh no, how did it go at the station? What offense did our king commit? Hmm. <laughs> it is a shame. A total mess. In fact, more than an abomination. I don't understand. What happened? First time in history, a king will perpetuate such an abominable act in Umobu. Hi! Oh no. <laughs> I'm still in the dark. Please, enlighten me the more. Pico. Our king is a murderer. Yes. What offense did he commit? Mm. He stole a child at birth from a certain family. And connived with the worker in the hospital and made away with a male child. Now he killed the worker and his wife to cover up the secret. Huh? What? Hey. I'm still caught up in the shock. Was that his confession? There's an eyewitness. Eyewitness? Who? Nebechi, the palace head maid. Are you serious? Now, where is that stolen child? Prince Dozier. Mm -hmm. Oh no, wait a minute. <laughs> Dozier is the stolen child. That means it happened long time ago. How, how come in the Bechi, the palace met? Uh, Witness the mother of the, the hospital worker and his wife. How? The worker and the wife and the bitch's parents. The confession was clear. But let me take it step by step. On the day of delivery, our queen gave birth to a baby girl. And the king wasn't happy about it. Eventually, the baby died. Huh. And the king connived with a worker on duty and exchanged another man's child, a boy, without the queen's knowledge. Hmm. When Nebechi's father decided to let the truth out it became an issue between him and the king hmm? Hmm. Hmm. now it's becoming clear yes. 
the image is becoming vividly clear. However, the worker had a 10 year old daughter who happens to be Nebechi. She witnessed a conversation with the king and how he bribed a father till the day King Induka shot a father and a mother right before our eyes in cold blood. Hawaii <sighs> is indeed a heartless king. Oh yes! Move your jaw. Now the king has been sentenced to life imprisonment. The throne is now empty. He had no son, yes. no heir to the throne. Which heir are you talking about? Which heir? Have you forgotten he forcefully took over that kingship? Which heir? You know where you are? This is Nollywood Pictures.